Welcome to another video dedicated to the Willis firmware. It's great to have you back as we will continue here to test with the breadboard the higher functionality. I will wire both higher LED transmitter and receiver. Since no micro SD card reader is hooked up, I will only learn and replay higher signal. The higher sending LED is connected to pin 10 and ground and the receiver to pin 44 and ground and the transistor is not connected yet. I don't have a physical remote control. So in the meantime, I will use the flipper zero with the universal mute button. I am setting up wheelies to learn a fresh infrared signal. Following that, I will press the mute button on the Flipper Zero Universal Remote. Here we go, signal received with a protocol on Q. Now let's reverse the role. We will set the Flipper Zero to learn mode while the wheelie takes on the task of replaying the signal. I have observed that the protocol identification is different between Willy and Flipper Zero. Initially, I suspected that Willy wasn't replaying the signal accurately. To address this, I installed the transistor to enhance the signal's quality and power. Despite this modification, the results remain unchanged. It was then that I realized Flipper Zero display only the last 8 bits of the signal. While the protocol appear different to me, they likely share simulatories but have different names. Make sure to subscribe and like this video for further exploration into Willy's firmware and stay tuned in the next episode where I'm planning to introduce a complete shield.